Homosexuality is an element in this story. It is part of what Sharon is intimately dealing with. But how I think this story is so much bigger is that it's more about, about being the other. It's about being that person who doesn't quite fit in the tribe and how that becomes uh, a way in which other people uh, get to see you as a target and therefore you're persecuted. And then the struggles that one might deal with to accept his or herself and to embrace themselves and love themselves. Um, and then on top of that, he's dealing with some very real issues with his mother and he's having to be the, the adult in the home because of her having a crippling drug addiction. Um, it gets into to masculinity and father figures and who it is that, that at least in these, these environments that African-Americans have access to, who they look up to, to take their cues from, uh, to get direction that, and in that way, like who is it that are informing their manhood? And who is it that says that I love you? And who is it that says it's okay to be you, however you interpret yourself to be? Um, so it's, it's, this, is, this is the most kind of profound, impactful, story that I've ever had the, the honor of working on because it gets into some very real issues and things that, that we haven't had this mirror held up in our society yet, touching on people who are struggling and dealing with, with this.